Hello friends, welcome to this session of Learning R Programming. And in this session, we are going to learn how to add citations in R Markdown. The first requirement to get citations in R Markdown is to have a BibTeX file. A BibTeX file is a file where your citations are entered as BibTeX entries. And to get those citations, you have to And this is the BibTeX file. This at indicates that BibTeX entry is starting. After that, this is the type of citation. This is article. If it is book, it will be written as book there. And in the curly bracket, that citation entry will be there or BibTeX entry will be there. And this is the identity of that entry, which we are going to use for citation in R Markdown. Now we will see how to get that BibTeX file. For that, search in your browser Zotero citation to BibTeX and click that. And here you will get that zbib.org, Zotero Zotero bib and click that. Here you need to have an URL ISBN or DOI and I have this populated. I will remove this first and now I am with clean slate. I will just open another tab in browser and type there my search term that is rhizobium root nodules NCR peptides membrane. These are my keywords and I will click that and these citations are there which I require to be cited in my article. I will run that and here that DOI is there. I will copy that DOI, bring that to Zotero. I will type here and click cite there and this will get added here. This is and here also modern language association that is here also. Now will move again go back get another one this nitrogen fixing rhizobium legume symbiosis it's by G Maruti and this DOI I will copy and bring that to Zotero click that site it got populated it got here and I will go for the third one for the demonstration purpose will go for only three citations and here again that DOI is there. I will copy this DOI, will bring that DOI to zotero.bib site and the third is also there in my list. Now here that export tab is there, button is there. I will go there and download bibtech. I will click this so that bibtech file will get downloaded. Now this file is there in my download folder open. This file is there. I will just save that file, save as to my Rworks folder and citations in our, I will create one another folder, new folder for that. Citations new and open that. Here I will just save that as citations.bib save. Now my bib file is there with me in my new folder. I'll open the folder R works that citations new. This citations file is there. Now in this file only I will save my R markdown. I will go here, go to file, new file, R markdown and citations demo will be the title. This HTML output it will be. I will keep that as such now and will uh, click OK. I have got this now new file untitled one and there this YML header is there with title author date and all that and all that from the template I will keep as such. I will run this to see the uh, output and here I will put that into the folder citations new and type there citation demo save that and now my R markdown file have got saved in the folder in which I have added my citation file 
and I clicked that neat also here I clicked that neat and document got neated down to HTML document format this is HTML and uh, this is the document where I will add citations now we'll go to our markdown and uh, here I want to add my citation just give a space and type this at this at tells this neater that citation is coming and this citation I will bring from this uh, b file citation b file and this ID I will use for that copy the ID and bring that ID to our markdown here run that use another also here at and go back to the citation file that Maruti is there this one second one and bring that to our markdown put that here and somewhere here at the end also I will put that at a space at and go back to copy the citation that Kim antimicrobial I will copy this is the ID which we require ID I have copied and I have brought that here I will neat now and we'll see uh, whether it gets added into citation or not it has not got added into citation why I will tell you because I forgot here to tell R from where that bibliography will come therefore in YAML header I will type the term bibliography give a colon there and name of the bib file that is citation dot bib and will confirm whether the name is citation dot bib or not yes it is citations therefore we'll add s in our r markdown and we'll knit again now knitting is going on and in the html it will show us the citations yeah the references the three references which i have added got added to this uh, HTML file and inline citation also we'll see here that citation is there here that citation is there and at the end also here one citation is there okay. now another very important thing to get uh, citations in proper format is the citation style and for that you need to have a proper CSL that citation style and here I will put that CSL and uh, here we need to add the citation uh, style file and how to get that citation style file again go to Google and type there Zotero citation styles and run that and here that Zotero style repository is there run that click that and here type the journal journal name uh, for which you want to uh, submit your article or which reference style you want to use here I will go for that National Academy of Sciences Academy of Sciences and here that is United States America I will run that and the citation style gets downloaded I will go to the folder show in folder and that is in my download folder I will copy this citation style and bring that to my folder where I have added or directory where I have added my document I will paste that there PNA style okay. and name of the style is PNAS I will add that name here CSL PNAS dot CSL and will need again and citation style will get changed earlier it was name of the author followed by uh, year and that now here the number is there here also sequential number of citation is there and uh, at the end also these three citations are there okay. these are also now numbered if you want to have their title at the end I will add a section references and will need again and will see the effect in HTML yeah, references are there and these three citations are there inline citations are there if you want to have another style uh, this time I will go for the nature style nature acta nature I will select this time and the file got there acta nature I will go 
to the folder i will copy this and i will bring that to this folder where my citation file is there and this acta nature i will copy citation style i will bring that to my r markdown and in csl i will paste that name now my citation style will be acta nature i will run that and we'll see that into html and here that inline citation instead of parenthesis now square brackets are there and one two here that three is there and uh, the citation style got changed this is how easy it is to get citations we'll see those in pdf also because a uh, pdf is more like the document which we submit need that pdf document and here we will get that pdf and here that pdf is there this is the inline citation you can see and at the end also that uh, citation list is there and uh, you can click on these links here also i think those links may be clickable it's not okay and uh, this is how easy it is to uh, cite your document uh your articles using r markdown thanks for watching this video if you like this video please click the like button if you are not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and click that notification icon so that you will get notifications of my new videos thanks thanks for watching